Howdy YouTube, Macaulay's here, um, doing a, another video about 45 seconds after we finished a, recording a separate video. This one might actually go up first, um, but I mentioned something in the other video. I mentioned that in Legends, that, would, well, you know, hashtag my canon, was that the original lightsabers were actually like backpack battery operated lightsabers that had a power cable going from the hilt to the backpack battery. And that actually it was, you know, huge potential problem because then all you gotta do is cut that cable and you don't have a lightsaber anymore. And she made a funny face and said something. What is it that you said? It triggers me. <laughs> so yes, I'm the wife and just another disclosure, I married into the Star Wars fandom, so whenever he talks Star Wars, I just put in my, you know, my she puts two in cents, her She puts in her, her wife earplugs, which, really... fi which filter just enough to get triggered, yeah. but not enough to actually retain any of Star Wars information. I've retained very little. It's but, like her talking about her work day. But still. I put in my husband earplugs. It just... So... I mean, the best part is I have an argument to immediately shut all of this down, but I, I want you to, to explain why this triggers you. Okay. I would have been more interested in the lightsabers had they have been, like, usable with the Force. Since they were the weapons of Force users... Why not make them, like, force-activated, force-powered, force... She has talked about this in the past. And I'll tell you, Disney's new canon with kyber crystals sort of mixes in your belief about, like, having... Let's scoot over a bit more. Having, like, more of a force-imbued... Yeah, the, the chair's weird. Yeah, the chair's weird. Having more of a force-imbued, like, weapon. More force-imbued lightsaber, because obviously now... The kyber crystal speaks to that individual force user and they imbue their force energy into the kyber crystal and that's how we get the color now the lightsaber itself this i remember i remember we had a conversation about this years ago and this actually triggered her i was telling her lightsabers are like i actually no. i think what started this was when finn used the lightsaber in, in episode seven and you were like yes how does he use it he doesn't does he have the force and i was like you don't have to have the force to turn a lightsaber on and swing it she was like, "Wait, what?" I was like, it "Yeah." It just seems so like. Yeah, you don't have archaic. to. You don't. You don't channel the force through the lightsaber. And I, I, I will give her credit. Definitely, I can see how, from an outside viewpoint, even from an inside viewpoint, where the concept that the lightsaber doesn't require force user to activate and to use now. Keep in mind, I understand, and she as well understands, there's a difference between activate and use, or, like, actually use to its peak ability. Non-force users cannot control, they don't have enough control of their body, their, you know, area of surroundings, um, and training to really control a lightsaber properly and fight with it. Um, now I'll say this Disney canon has sort of added in a few characters who can. Um, such as, uh, gosh, what is the, I can't remember the Mandalorian guy who uses the dark saber against Maul. Maul dispatches him quickly, but he can use the lightsaber. It's a sword. It's now, I know, uh, another throw in here, George Lucas originally said they were like medieval swords, like super heavy. Um, and then of course that sort of changed when the prequels came out and all of a sudden everyone's like one handed wheeling this, you know, swinging it around all willy nilly. Um, but my, my argument that kind of shuts your, your hashtag triggering down is how big did computers used to be? Yes. Like the size of rooms. Now we are w looking into a pocket sized computer. And so it's the same way with technology in the Star Wars universe where they were able to compact that into hashtag lithium ion batteries. I don't know why I keep saying hashtag. It would have just been so much cooler if... You're not triggered by the backpack, you're triggered by the battery. I, yes, I'm triggered by the battery. The battery bugs. Like, yes, I get the battery pack, it's new, whatever. But, you have the force. Like, you can do all these other things with the force. Manipulate your body, manipulate the force itself. You know, but you can't use it 
in your lightsaber. So it's just kind of like, that would have been so much cooler because then as you got weaker because you got your butt kicked in a battle, you're, <laughs> you know. Well, I'm, I'm laughing. I'm, I'm, doing, I'm, doing I'm, doing I'm doing my ugly smirk because I'm remembering uh, Sith swords, which were a precursor to lightsabers, which were force imbued weapons. So it wasn't kyber crystals, wasn't anything like that. It was literally Sith rituals to imbue their weapons with the force. That would be, I think, to your liking more than the modern day lightsaber. Because that is... Now, again, you don't, you, I don't think you would need the force to wield it. But if you wielded it without the force, it would just be a sword. And I think your argument is, like, you would be okay if the lightsaber was still able to be turned on. But, like, it was weaker and... Like, the force user is what gave it its strength and stuff like that. But I cannot think of a logistical way for you to do that with a plasma weapon. Because that's all a lightsaber is. It's contained plasma energy. So you could do it with, like, a sword or a staff or something. You know, in D&D, you have magical items. They're imbued with magic. It's the same way Sith swords worked in Legends, was you had a sword... You had a weapon that you would imbue with dark side energy, and it made it more powerful than the tip other swords that they would go up against. But, yeah. But then how would you control the plasma? Well, there was no plasma in them. They were actual, like, metal swords. They were just made stronger with the force. Yeah. Either way, I don't like batteries. I think that's that's... She doesn't like batteries because, like she's kind of mentioned, the, the Force can supposedly do all this other stuff, but it can't turn on a lightsaber. Yeah, your prime weapon. It's almost like For when me- you hear Jedi, you think lightsaber. When you hear Force user, you think of Jedi's Sith Force users. It's just like, but the battery, the battery. I just don't like it. Are we falling lower and lower? No, I think I... Well, maybe. We'll get better at this eventually. I'll get a real camera instead of <laughs> recording on my phone. We're going to probably get do more of these videos. Doesn't always have to be Star Wars. You all know me. Star Wars, guns, crap. I don't care. We'll make a YouTube video I'd rather it. it be something that I can just kind of pop in on. The one thing she has to get used to, she's over here like, well, we're going to edit these. Nuh-uh. Yeah. That's part of my allure. I learned that we don't edit. It's part of my charm. I'm a one-shot take kind of guy. If we're eight minutes into this, if we wanted to, to, if we messed up and wanted to do something, guess what? We're saying all this all over again. Um, I mean, I'm, I, I, I understand where you're coming from, and I'm not saying I disagree with you on it loses its sort of like mysticalness, but I mean, at the same time, it's still, it's not. It's really the the idea, like, it takes a skilled warrior to use a lightsaber. So, that that's, that's I, I understand, but there's no good explanation to appease your triggering. There's another thing with kyber crystals that, um, I don't know, did that change from Legends to... Yes, this. and we will talk about that in another video. In another video, okay. Because I know there was another thing with that that kind of bugged me, but what really interested me was the new stuff. Which, again, I married into it, so please don't hate me, but <laughs> just put it in my two cents. Just be glad we're recruiting a new one. What do you mean? A new new person to talk about Star Wars with. and I, I wouldn't... To, you're not a fan, but, like... Hell, you're doing a YouTube video about Star Wars. I kind of made you because I wanted to get in on on this too. But. I, I think I, I'm pretty sure I don't have the ritualistic subscribers. I don't ever ask for subscribers. I post these because, oh. yeah, it's kind of a stress relief. Cool. Well, we can sign off now. Okay, I'll let you hit the button. Y'all have a good one.